Hey everyone, it's Chris at Unior USA. Uh, just a quick one today to show you the big brother of the smaller electronic torque wrench we highlighted before. This is the bigger one, half inch drive, 4.3 to 85 Newton meters. Same settings as the smaller one, the quarter inch, one to 20 Newton meter. Just a little bit bigger form. This is what you'll reach for when it's time to do bottom brackets or free hubs and things like that. So to avoid telling you something you probably already know how to do. I've already taken the liberty of removing the bottom bracket, cleaning it, inspecting it, and now it's time to reassemble everything. I've threaded it in as far as it's going to go by hand, and now using our 1671 BSA 30 bottom bracket socket and our torque wrench, we're going to bring it up to SRAM's recommended spec. This is a SRAM dub BSA 30 bottom bracket, and the recommended install torque is 50 newton meters. So we're going to just set that to 50 and set it to spin in the correct direction and we'll start to tighten. As with the smaller one, once we get to 95% of the recommended torque, it'll start to beep and one LED will light. When we get to 100%, the tone will go steady and the second LED will light. Simple as that. We'll flip the direction. And do it again on the other side. And now our bottom bracket is torqued and we're ready to install the crank set. So to give you a little bit better view of what's actually going on, this is our wrench. And as I mentioned, the uh, recommended install torque for this BSA 30 dub bottom bracket is 50 Newton meters. So as you can see, we're set to 50. Uh, if you look, well, you can't really see it in the video, but um, it, the wrench has four different units to pick from, and that's also set to Newton meters. If we needed a different value, we've got two up and down, or one each up and down arrows here, and we can just go a tenth at a time, or if we want a bigger adjustment, we just hold it. Super easy. Let's go back down to 50. And if you remember, I said once we get to 95% of our install torque, we'll see this lower green LED light up and it'll start to beep. And once we get to 100%, we'll see this upper red LED light and the toner goes steady. So let's see if we can pick that up um, here in the video. Let's change direction. 